Sophia Charlotte was born on May 19, 1744, in Miro, Duchy of mecklenburg strelitz Germany. On September 8, 1761, at the age of 17, Charlotte married King George III at St. James Palace in London. She had just arrived on the shore of her new home the day before, having had no prior meeting with the king or any members of the royal family. She spoke no English on arrival, but is said to have quickly learned to speak the language, although with a heavy German accent. She was fluent in French and read some Latin. Most Americans are familiar with George III, as he was sovereign at the time the Continental Congress sent him the Declaration of Independence. Some may have learned the name of his queen consort and her accomplishments, but her ethnicity had been ignored or denied by most textbooks and historical writers. Charlotte's depiction as a person of color was unusual for her time. Artists were inclined to soften a subject's features, or in the case of prominent persons of color, to whitewash them. Sir Alan Ramsey portrayed Charlotte as distinctively mulatto. Ramsey was an outspoken abolitionist and an uncle by marriage of Dido Elizabeth Bell Lindsay. Dido was the mulatto daughter of a Royal British Navy captain, Sir John Lindsay, and an African slave that he kidnapped from the Caribbean named Maria Bell. Lindsay sent Dido to his uncle William Murray, the first Earl of Mansfield, and his wife, who were childless. The Murrays raised both Dido and her first cousin, once removed, Elizabeth Murray. Ramsay's anti-slavery sentiments and connection to Dido may have influenced his portrayal of Charlotte as she really was. Charlotte's friend and physician to her grandchildren described her as having true mulatto features. Charlotte's genealogy reflects 75 generations of Africans and intermarriage with Portuguese royals. She is the grandmother of Queen Victoria and Prince Albert. Eleven of her children married European royals. As a result, every royal family from Spain to Scandinavia is a descendant of Charlotte.